Okay, uh, good morning. It's gonna be an exciting day today because uh, I don't know, I'm a little bit shaking at the same time, so I don't know, and a little bit of a headache. So I don't know, probably as a part of the excitement or what. The anxiety feeling is unexplainable. <laughs> I don't know and plus it's raining outside so whew, there's so many things going on but so I my appointment start at 1 uh, 20 p.m. so I had to leave early at home so right now it's 12 50 p.m. so hopefully uh, this one uh, will not gonna take longer and because when I check uh, for the appointment there are only like uh, four uh, available slots on that particular time so again i'll keep you updated okay so see you in a bit i'm driving down now to uh, downtown long beach okay yeah, convention center convention center this thing is beautiful yeah, this thing is Walking. I'm walking. I don't know kung saan nandaanan papunta lang para magpa-vaccine but I guess this is the right way hopefully. I don't know where's the entrance. I'll we'll figure it out in a few minutes. I'm walking right here. So it's like nobody in here. I'll we'll check if this is open. That is Long Beach Convention Center. So, let me check the okay. I don't know. Where's the right here. Okay, finally, na tapos na din ang aking uh, kalbaryo para hanapin tong uh, vaccination area. So far, na tapos na. So I walk for maybe an uh, I'll call it a mile and a half just to find this place. But after that. I finally found where it is. It's in Long Beach Terrace Center. So it took me like a, maybe a less than the 10 seconds. And then uh, I got my uh, first vaccine from Pfizer. So at first, yung experience ko parang medyo a little bit uh, high yung left arm ko. Kung saan uh, dinaxin yung first dose. And uh, guess what? This is what I got right here. So I got my first uh, COVID-19 vaccination report card. So I've heard that you need this one. You have to keep this one, especially if you're going to travel uh, abroad or uh, travel outside the uh, uh, state. So it might be implemented in the next year. So it's better to be safe than be sorry. So again, that is my journey having my first vaccination and it's raining and it took me like uh, 25 minutes just to find the place but anyway I'm done and I'm heading home now and see what will be the uh, the after vaccination effect and how it's gonna be uh, uh, my uh, feeling on my right arm I've heard that you're gonna feel a little bit sore and a little bit pain but other than that you're, you're pretty good it's a normal stuff you can still go back to work that's what I feel right now so the only uh, complaint that I have is they don't have enough signs saying that you have to go this way you're going to get this one or such, such and such so it took me like 25 minutes just to find the place but other than that thank you Thank you to Long Beach Unified for giving us a free vaccine. Appreciate it. Okay, we'll talk to you soon when I get home. Okay, bye bye bye. Yes. Yeah, I'm seeing them all. How about online? Just to get the vaccine. So, thank you. Okay, finally, I'm done with my uh, first vaccination and. Uh, Finally, I'm done with my first uh, vaccination uh, dose. 
finally I'm done with the first dose of my uh, vaccine so I have to uh, wait for another uh, 21 days uh, in order for me to uh, get back my second dose uh, from Pfizer so the good thing about this is it's sponsored by our uh, our uh, employer which is the school uh, Long Beach Unified School District so I'm pretty sure a lot of teachers already got their uh, vaccine uh, I think since Monday but uh, I think the others are still uh, having a problem to uh, get the, uh, the schedule to get their uh, vaccine so luckily when I uh, checked out last night there's still some uh, remaining uh, uh, slots for for today but definitely I'm, sh I'm, I'm pretty sure there's still a lot available all you have to do is just to be uh, patient but uh, the reason why we got this because uh, we're on this schedule and I know there are some other uh, people that have been waiting for so long but I think it's, it's a case-to-case -case basis and since we are uh, uh, going to uh, face with our students in in March or in the next uh, few months so definitely it's required for us teachers to have a protection at the same time uh, from students and since we are going to have a uh, close contact with the students so it is very um, imperative that we need to have that uh, protection which is the uh, corona virus uh, uh, vaccine so Another thing is uh, from what I've heard that if you are not yet vaccinated it might uh, uh, affect your uh, travel because they will require you now to uh, present a uh, vaccination card stating that you already had it in order for you to travel outside the US or travel uh, in other uh, part of uh, the United States which is in other uh, states so I'm not pretty sure on that one but definitely I'm sure it will gonna be happening so so it's good to uh, be early and prompt on this uh, uh, manner especially when it's uh, given for free by our uh, school district so I took that uh, opportunity to have it and I, I know uh, I wish my wife uh, could get this as well so that both of us will be protected uh, and also uh, our whole family and I'm sure a lot of still waiting for it so I I'm just uh, one of the lucky uh, one who got it uh, on time I uh, booked it uh, last night and I got it right away and then I said yes I'm going to take that spot but if you are not comfortable uh, to do it right now so maybe you are not not sure if, whether you're going to take it or not or maybe you're a little bit uh, hesitant or uh, afraid well it's always up with you so you know choose the date that you're gonna be prepared and choose the date that you're gonna be ready to do it you know chances are you're still gonna get it because you need it uh, especially if you're going to uh, uh, have a uh, close contact with other people and also if you work in the uh, 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 people uh, where the environment is uh, a lot of people you're going to interact with so you have to but if you're just going to work from home so definitely you don't have to uh, get it right away in my case it's required by our uh, by our district so that's the reason why I took it uh, today so another thing is after this first vaccine I had to uh, go back again to get my second dose after 21 days so we'll see what will be the effect tonight but I've heard that uh, some of my co-workers saying that you know just be ready it might be sore for the next uh, one or two days but you know it's still you're gonna go back to a normal uh, routine so you don't have to uh, uh, worried about it uh, I heard a lot of negative things uh, about the effect of it but I, I'm not gonna worry about it you know it's just a protection and you know the chances are it's only once in a million that you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna die but I'm not uh, aiming for that one so the reason why I uh, had this uh, vaccine is because I want to uh, have a protection for myself from, uh, from other people and also for my uh, 
family, my children, my wife, and also uh, to my students. So I think that's all I can say. Uh, other than medyo a little bit na parang tired yung left arm ko after uh, the, sh the shot. So hopefully it gets better. So medyo parang nangangalay and kind of like uh, so tired. It's a, a little bit heavy on uh, my left arm. So I don't know. Maybe that's the uh, the effect of the vaccine, but nothing is really uh, to be scared of. So I'm still able to drive on the way home. So anyway, thank you so much uh, for watching. I'm going to keep you updated soon. What will be the you know my situation? But other than that, I don't think so. There's any uh, kind of major major things gonna happen. You know. And I'm so glad that I already had this one so that I don't need to worry that what if just in case so on and so forth again uh, had my first dose of uh, coronavirus uh, or COVID-19 uh, vaccination first dose today uh, what's that January 29 2021 is a history <laughs> okay thank you so much for watching and I'll keep you updated soon. Thank you and have a pleasant Friday. Okay? It's a rainy Sunday today here in Long Beach. Okay? So thank you. Thank you so much. And God bless everyone.